So hey what's up guys this side Ara when you're watching a trick radio studio channel so in this video i'll be talking about what you say spark os because many of days spark os doesn't providing us any update over any devices that which, which i know personally so and it is an unofficial build so don't think that is an or it is official build so we got a version of 13.13 which is uh, mentioned as device mojito and release type is unofficial and maintainer is unknown and if you click on android version you get that android 13 e smooth easter egg and by the way guys a very happy new year to all of you from my side and please try to get us 100 subscribers done from my uh, from this 2023 march apart from that this chipset and we got in december security update with the kernel version of west coast super fast which is so much what do you say providing a better performance and smoothness in this room and we got 664 written as my device what do you say specifications in the network internet settings you get that all the things what do you say i haven't faced any of the issues in the network internet settings you get data savers also connected device no issues in the display section you get that customizations option like tap to wake live display you can calibrate your display night light smallest width and what do you say display it size and text you can select bold text too in this room and there is one special things i want to note that there you are not getting any theme palette in this room but you can just enable what do you say uh, theme icon so from here you can generally enable and here you got the option of what do you say game space too, but the game space I would not going to recommend because I, in many of the rooms I have checked that is not working all around fine apart from that we got notification you can enable notification history from here and your notification gets saved nothing much more had been added for the batteries and I have used this room for the all the testing and batteries performing outside Being in terms of my performance my performance does not consist of any type of gaming and my performance my performance also does not consist of any always on display apart from that here you get the idle manager it stops all the non-essential background process when your device is an idle percent and here you got the accessibility option talk back and every option is there from the security point of view you're getting facing off and fingerprint unlock over there here's the what do you say password and account in the system option you get that gestures option in the gestures you can customize nfpil bar and haptic feedback is also been there but i haven't feel the haptic feedback i don't know why but the haptic feedback i haven't faced the haptic feedback in this room so might be there is an issue over the haptic feedback apart from all the things we are working and if you also go to languages and input and suddenly I want to say that the app language support on this room is much more than previous rooms. And here all the things I have done with all the room about the room. Secondly, if you talk about the fireworks, you get that option of themes and you can select a monet engine. You can use custom themes from here and custom wallpaper picker theme from your here. You can use that and custom lightness scale is also been there working. And these all the settings are working fine. You get the main menu uh, layout like Oxygen OS. It will restart this icon and it will get changed. You can see that it gets changed. So no issues that you can face in this part also in that. Apart from here, you get all the options of the menus, header, user card. There is much more customization. I will not go in that details because if I go, then it will spoil it to you because you have to just enjoy this room at your own so i will not go into that detail but yeah i can say that uh, everything is working fine you get that the latest what do you say security update which is nice to see you get the so qs footer text and here you can see that spark has been written you can subscribe to all the channel to uh, my content that i am delivering you so please subscribe and put a like on my video so we will get what do you say 1000 subscribers soon and a volume panel styles is also there you can select realme ui style and you can see that the realme ui style is also been there and working fine you get much more options also two three options and the what do you say lock screen option is there ambient display aod here is the option you can customize that these settings 
we are already working fine so you can do check out these settings you get that pulse option the fireworks again back to that gestures i talked about you that the volume rocker wake is also been there like if i just turn off and turn on with volume wake options too apart from that there is a miscellaneous option notification lights battery light is there screen off animation like you can select the scale and it will get turned off so you can use these settings according to your usage these are all working fine kill app button is also been there whenever it will come you can see that it will after the restart of the device it will get shown in your device you get that unlimited photo storage and unlock higher fps in games and sensor block per package is also been there if you don't know about these settings please don't touch these settings because if you touch and might be possible there will be a problem issues on this on your device so don't try to use that and everything has been done from my side you can see that every customizations you can select and what do you say let me enable all those for those who think that it is not working so you can see that it is working fine so so now if you talk about the performance results that i have run in this room so you have surprised to see what the scores that i have mentioned first of all those who are asking for wildlife extreme test is the 137 overall score and this is not pretty good score after that you get that l1 certification you can run your netflix too easily without hassles here is the safety net test and it is passed so yeah no issues this is a cpu throttling test which is run for 9 minutes for 92% max performance and here is the 156 gips max is there apart from that the device certification is also been there and this is the what you say an pretty average multi core score of the geekbench you can see this and i don't like these scores now if you talked about me what is the what i can suggest you to use this room or not in 2023 yeah i can suggest but there is quick quack catch because uh sometimes the charging sucks yeah the charging takes little bit of time in uh, what do you say randomly it will take time to get charged fully but sometimes it will automatically charge at its 33 watt level so yeah that is a question from my side to your all now if you ask me about the smoothness of the room you can see that the smoothness of the room and this is all we working fine and no no stutters lag i have so faced so far here is no lag in the quick settings panel you can see it see that no lags has been found in my usage case and if you found any sort of issues you can see that the smoothness is too good and yeah overall i think that uh, this room is usable to all of you you can use this room banking apps do run easily so you can use this and you can see that the how smooth it is working so yeah this is all for right now guys if you found the video really really awesome then please please subscribe because it doesn't really cost you anything but it really motivates me to create an awesome level of content for yours so my name is arav i am signing you off we'll meet in the next video till then bye bye